Okay, I'm Grace. I'm the lead singer and bass player. I'm Gabriella, and I play the guitar and sing background vocals. I'm Scarlett, and I'm a drummer and sing background vocals. And this is Hello, this is Sister. So Hello Sister. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, welcome, girls. Great to Thank have you. Thank you. Today. Thank you for having us. So yes. how has quarantine life been? Um, it's been pretty good. Scott's doing a lot of baking. Yes, we've been doing a lot of cooking and baking, and we've kind of, um, of course, practicing music. Yeah, we're doing we've a lot of music. Been we have trying time. to take advantage of this time um, where we aren't as busy with doing more music, shooting more little films and stuff. Um, mm-hmm. So yeah, that's what we're working on right now. Yeah, I saw you had two different projects that you were working on. One being. Um, the Pop Through the Decade series, and then I saw another series on there as well? Yes. yes. Um, oh, yes. Um, we have Pop Through the Decades. It's really cool. It's us exploring um, the history of music. You can check that out, the link in our bio, our YouTube channel. And we also have an animated series. And that's yes. Mission House. So where did so where kind of did the concepts from those come from? Um, well, Mission House Sister is a kind of animated series where we are kind of little music, yeah, say a lot of music, kind of like middle school and how we say, but um, we're going to be saving our world through music. And then Pop of the Decades, we actually are going back, back in time, we're kind of looking at uh, music throughout the decades and exploring that and maybe meeting some people who have made really made an impact on music today or if they know people yeah. and so that's kind of how it is right yeah now. basically like throughout the episode we pick a artist and you can see which artist we pick in the episode and we learn all about the song and we have other people to learn about too yeah, yeah. Nice. nice well do you have a lot of uh, influences from back in the early days uh, yes, our dad was a big influence, and he really brought us, well, our parents brought us, like, to all the uh, older music, so, like, yes. the 80s music. Yes. We listened to a lot of that. Uh-huh. Our dad always blasts the 80s music, the 80s 80s music, music in the yes, car. Yes, definitely. <laughs> so, would you say that's where you get your unique sound from? Yeah. Yeah, we actually have been, expo- we, well, our parents exposed us to a lot of different styles of music mm-hmm. and a variety of things. So um, I yeah. guess we kind of pick up on different musics and that's how we get ours. Mm-hmm. But, but how did you guys get started? Um, our dad was a really big influence. Usually he'd be like playing the guitar around the house. Um, and we always sing along to it. Yes. I, I've been singing since I was like, I remember when I was like, or when I like, got in the screen, and we had like baby videos of like Gabriella playing, like slamming the guitar, and then I was like holding I don't know what I was holding, but I was holding these things and I was jamming on like these paint buckets, um, hitting on them, <laughs> yeah. And then Grace was like singing, of course, she, there's so much baby videos of Grace and us singing, yeah. but um, and so we kind of we kind of picked our instruments when we were like really young, which is so mm-hmm. weird because we kept on kept those instruments when we got older, but um, and then we just started taking lessons after that, and I don't know, it kind of just came together. Yeah. Our parents like originally wanted us to start a band because our dad was a musician too, so it just yeah, it all came together. Really. <laughs> What would you say is your biggest dream? Our biggest dream. Uh, uh, we really want to get our music out there. Um, for us, probably being in front of a really big audience, like arenas. Yeah, that arenas. Cool. Yeah. That's one of our biggest dreams. So yeah. you've also been doing a thing on Instagram called Cover Mondays. Tell us about that. Yeah. Um, basically every week we pick a trending song or it could be like any genre because we like all different genres of music and we do a quick a minute cover of it and it's super cool yes we post it on our instagrams and tiktoks and youtube every monday which is today so we'll be (laughs) posting one today so how do you decide what song that you're going to pick um it kind of depends sometimes we're either just um searching out songs that are trending right now like the billboards or just songs that we've really liked to jam out with yeah past, like a lot of it a lot of it is like when we're if we're on tiktok and stuff when you hear some oh like, trending we'll do it we like doing um 
we like to know songs that people like and we like as well. So it's kind of just, um, it depends on if these are the trendy songs and what we like to do. Gotcha. Well, cool. So being in summertime, what are your summer plans? What are your like favorite things to do during the summer? Mm. We've gone to the beach like I think yeah. two times. Yeah. That's probably We're our planning favorite. too. And like hanging out with friends, doing things you wouldn't really be able to do because you're busy during the year. And usually what we do is because all of our family is from Canada actually, like our parents grew up in Canada. Yeah. So usually every summer we go to Canada to visit all our family. But the border's gonna be closed, so we're probably just gonna go in the winter time. Yes. So but still, it's like we do a lot of the winter activities, so it's super fun. Mm -hmm. If we've gone skiing, or the other ones, sledding, uh, uh, sledding, sledding. I don't yeah. know. We don't really know the terms because we're before kids. Skiing. But <laughs> yeah. Well, fun. Do you have a current single out right now that you'd like to promote? Yes, we actually have a few out. We have middle schooler summertime which is perfect for this season, summer. Yes. Um, and then we have Kids in the Adult World out, and we have much more to come. Yeah, you can, you can find it all of, on our, all of our music platforms, on Spotify, Hello Sister, and just on our YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. And iTunes. And iTunes, mm -hmm. yes. Well, awesome. What do you guys have planned next? Mm -hmm. um, well, we're just waiting to hear from, because our Pop for the Decades was pitched, so we're waiting to see the exciting news from that. Yes. And we're just, we're working in the studio right now. And there's yes, a lot definitely. of more new originals coming. Writing so. more songs. We hopefully can make, um, start working on episode two, Pope the Decades. Um, and for the animated series, episode two. Yes. So we're working on all that stuff, but we're excited. 